Hey guys, I'm back with episode 13 of my Let's Play series. Uh, for this episode, since you guys haven't gotten back to me on the previous question of or did you want to see Up City, I think I am going to Up City and this is also to make up for the lack of zombie killing in the previous episode. So let's just quickly get everything we need. Um, we might need some steel just to repair this pick. Let's just do that and repair it now. Oh, not repair it now, I'll just do this for now. Okay, so um, yeah, let's go to the city and do some zombie killing. I want to see if I can also. Oh, I have to go down. Almost forgot that I made the mini bike entrance thing now. Um, I want to see if I can just. I'm just going to go there to loot the stores, and then all the other buildings I'll loot off camera. I'll do the same with the town, or rather, uh, it's up to you guys. Do you want to see me do the other town as well? As I told you that here on the map, I do have this town that I haven't checked out yet. So do you want to see me do the stores for this as well, or only the stores for the city? And then next time, I, I don't know, maybe we can just continue with the building or something like that. I'm actually considering doing this now, uh, where we do the up city run. Um, and then I'm going to do a few days off camera, like not just one or two days. I'm going to see if I can go from day 57 to day 90, for example. And I'm just going to do a lot of mining and upgrading to the base and then bring you guys back when this base is more or less done. And then if there's enough time before Alpha 16, we'll start with the snow base. See, with this entrance, it picks up steam and then all of a sudden it slacks down. Come on. Aim properly, John. And out you go. It's actually weird that you can fit out with a mini bike, but when you're walking or trying to fit through by going sideways, you can't. Um, let's just quickly see where the city is. It's this direction. There's so many stores in this area. I think we'll go block by block. So we're going to do a lot of zombie killing, and this is to make up for the fact that we didn't face a lot of zombies on camera for the horde. So this is the first one. I might just make this episode one super long one and that's to cover the whole looting of the stores because I don't want to spend too many episodes uh, doing the city. Uh, I'm just going to cut away, see you guys in a bit. Oh, before I forget, there's this camp over here. So let's just quickly do this. I just have to stand far away from the mines as to not get hit by them. Uh, there's one and there should be more in this area. It would suck if I were to die now. Come on, army guys. I'm saying army guys to include all the hazmat soldiers. Damn, I just don't want to get side. Uh, caught from the side, yeah. Damaged your leg somewhere, I see. Come on. The best is to hit them when they're stumbling, but my aiming seems to be off today. Let's just go in the trenches and see if we can get everything from the side. Where are you, zombie? Here you are. What I forgot to bring, of course, is the repair kits for the weapons. Because now I'm going to damage my shotgun in the city and there's not going to be any other weapons on me. Let's just hope I find proper weapon parts so I can actually um, repair it.
I just have to watch out for any landmines inside. If I'm not mistaken, there is one somewhere. Damn, these guys are tough. Could have sworn there were landmines inside as well. Just where was that? Okay, that was a deer. Phew. I should actually get used to saying stag, but for me that's a deer. Don't have any wrench on me, so I, unfortunately I can't take that um, cabinet apart. Let's just quickly make some space so we don't run out of space during the uh, Hub City run. Damn. Okay, so we got nice sniper rifle parts now. Just need to wait for that to open up a bit. It's going to take a while. Don't need to drop anything else for now. So the weapon parts we can assemble. And now we have three of the same. Damn. Actually, need a workbench now. Where was that now? I thought there might be another zombie over here. Okay, so where did I put the mini bike now? Should be on that side. Yep. Damn, shrapnel reaches far. Come on, come over here. Bullseye. See, as he stumbled, I took a shot and it actually did more damage. Took his whole head off. And now to just make some more space. I'm gonna read the books for now, although it doesn't help me reading them now. Since it won't do anything for me. It's a shame there's no other traders in the area, then I could quickly drop all of these things off there. So put the weapon parts in there, weapon, weapon, and expensive clothing and ammo. Don't need aloe vera, we have enough gunpowder at home. Uh, put the steel in there for now, paper, this, this, uh, this, this, and this. Okay, and let's be on our way. Now we just have to go around this place. I'm actually expecting quite a few dogs, so that's why I brought my shotgun instead of the sniper rifle. Come on. Where are all the zombies? That's the thing I miss about Alpha 14. Sure, it was extremely difficult, uh, but you couldn't even get into town. That's how difficult it was, but it was fun. Just make sure I'm fully reloaded. Get inside first and then outside. Off camera, I might just come back to the city to get all this iron that's over there. If I dismantle all of these shelves, I'll get a ton of iron, especially with the amount of stores in the area. Seems as my Skype has activated itself again. I just hope the zombie dogs don't corner us in the shop. And now to make some space over here. Damn. What a time to run out of space. Should actually quickly assemble a few things. Well, that's the only things I can assemble for now. And we're hunted. Damn it. And I only meant to shoot his head off, not open a hole. Damn. Let's just kill this guy. I 
Okay, now I'll make some space again. Uh, we can throw the feathers away, we don't need them anymore. Do we need these? Okay. Let's see if we can put a few things together. Nope, no other things fit together. So we'll have to put these in our mini bike. I have to be extremely careful for the sound of dogs. One thing Alpha 15 has gotten right, especially for the city, is this creepiness, this eeriness in the sky. You can just see it's a wasteland. Just wish I could make more space on me. I saw a do dog. Okay, let's go down. Can I mini bike? Okay, where is the here's the ladder? Just crash to see if we're detected or not. Damn, we're already getting full. We'll have to make a drop chest. Just so we can actually put all of these things away. Oh, I thought I was walking onto a landmine. Guys, watch out, the city also uh, does also have landmines, so you have to be careful where you walk. So first, let's put all the schematics and gun parts in, okay, and then the rest. I have to be careful not to use too much of my uh, shotguns uh, for all of useless things. For example, when I shoot a zombie I, and it's on the floor, I have to use my fire axe. Because if I just waste it on anything, I'm not gonna last here. Let's go to the uh, working stuff. Places like the hotel, I'll do off camera because that's just way too many floors to loot. It's gonna take ages. It almost sounds like he's inside. I think he might be in that room. Oh no, it's next door. Definitely outside. Sense, not a good thing. Oh, look at all the um, anvils I'm getting now. It's actually creepy having so many zombies around you. That's why I love this game, the eeriness. Even though I hate the shrieks of the uh, screamers, I love this effect that they give Av in the game. There's quite a few zombies outside now. As soon as I go to the back room, they're gonna start making noise. Yep, already seen. One more outside. Seems to be another fatso. I'm just gonna scrap all these. I can sell them, but uh, for the space, I just need to scrap them for now. Come on. Now he's gonna hunt me. It's a shame I didn't bring a level 600 with. Damn, I have so many schematics, the leather I can read, because that's still not full. I actually see if I've put any leather away in the minibike. 
It will be awesome if there's uh, leather schematics in the... No, oh, wait, I took everything out the mini bike. So there won't be anything in there now. Maybe we can... No, I need a better quality, so I'll just put this with the one I have. Uh, this one I can scrap. This one I can scrap. See, I'll get 505 for this, but I already have so much money at home anyways. So I don't care about that at the moment. Feathers I can get rid of, wood I can get rid of. Well, on to the next. I want to take my minibike with me everywhere, but it would actually be faster if I just go to the shops and leave my minibike at a certain spot. Only problem then is, if I get full, I have to run all the way back just for the minibike. Okay, so let's see what I can drop off here. I forgot to mark on the map where the, um, the drop chest is. So I'll just have to remember it's on the corner where we entered the city. Okay, and on we go. The next shop is to the left. I want to stay off the destroyed stone since that's where most of the mines are. The awesome part is we have that looting skill at level 3. So we can breeze through the places as long as we have space in our inventory. Sure, we don't always see what we grab, but still we can grab a lot. Okay, so obviously I'm not going to loot all the cars now, even if they're just outside these places. Because I want to get through this whole city in an episode or two. Oh shit. This place is bugged and there's a cop outside. Guys, this was the bug that I talked about uh, when we breezed through this place earlier with a mini um, minibike. Um, you can't place any blocks in this glitched area. And you can't fix this, doesn't matter if you uh, reload the game or check for errors, it's just broken. Still don't know what causes that error though. Man, it's nice having purple tools. Just breeze through these places. Okay, let's just click, quickly clear out a few things. If I'm not mistaken, there's also stuff on the roof, but I don't want to go through the pop now. And here is on the left. Damn, so I'll actually have to go into him because I want to go to this place now. Unless I go this way. Let's just hope there's no tin landmines. And there's no uh, of those cap landmines. I hate it when we have the same parts on us. It was different parts of the same gun, at least we could make some space. I'm kind of disappointed in the turnout for the zombies. Thought there would be way more on us. But I think if one zombie spots us, like a cop or something, it's going to spawn way more around us. If that cop sees us, we're in trouble. Come on, come on, come on. We'll have to kill it eventually since it's in our way. I'm actually hoping that the schematics you get here are schematics that you can actually read. Not the ones that we've already maxed out. Yes, leather. Leather and medicine are the ones we still need. Any weapon related ones like this book uh, we already have maxed. Okay, we have to read a few, drop a few, and scrap a few. I think after this one block we quickly have to drop off everything in that chest again. That's so we can make sure we always have space on us. Okay, let's see the armor as well. So armor, leather and science we still need to do. I think this one accounts for yep, weapon skill. 
and that's already done. So let's just quickly just grab these. Let's see, let's see. Did I get to yes, this is science. I don't know why it counts for science though. You think uh, auger accounts for mining? I want to sell all these other schematics. You can get a pretty penny for them. It's a shame that you can't uh, stack the schematics anymore. We'll have to scrap a few of these gun parts. Otherwise there won't be enough space for everything. Hopefully this is also science. Yes, it is. All our skills are almost maxed out, which I'm happy with. Guys, for this episode, there's barely going to be any cutout scenes, so... Okay, the weaponsmithing is already full, so we can drop that, drop this. Um, there's gonna, barely going to be any cutouts, so this is going to be one long episode. It might even be like two hours long. I don't know how long it's going to take for all the stores. So prepare yourself for a nice long looting. It's also nice because then we can get the up city behind us. Let's just see, we have to go back to the eye. For the chest. Also have to remember to mark it on the map now. I have this feeling that I'm going to have to make quite a few chests over here. If I had time, I'd sort it into more manageable stacks. For example, one chest can be stuff that we can uh, stack and one chest can't be stacked. But that's going to take way too long. Okay, so now next, I know there's a chicken over there, but we don't need the feathers. Next, we go for this block. Wait, almost forgot again. Uh, save, drop chest. Where did that cop go? Still walking over there. Okay, we're gonna try and avoid that guy for now. Guys, remember, if you take too long to take zombies out, then they can also call for friends. So you have to take zombies out as uh, fast as possible. It's a shame I didn't bring my sniper rifle as well. And any zombies walking closer I can kill. Who you knows, to save on time, I might just cut out a few buildings that I loot and just end the episode by showing what I got from that building. Or not the episode, end that shot of, or that I cut out. So for example, I'm looting this place now. Oh, except now that I'm talking, I'm not going to cut this one. I loot the place, I don't show you guys what I loot, and afterwards I show you what I got from it. As I, uh, Just before I go to the next building. Also guys, beware of places like these, uh, the zombies can walk through. They struggle a bit, but they can walk through. I have a range now, but I think I should rather just loot the normal stuff, and then later off camera I'll come back and dismantle. Because the dismantling itself will take quite a while. Let's just quickly make some space and scrap the easy things first. Don't want to put the brass first, otherwise it's going to clog up the queue. Unfortunately, all the other books are already maxed. I think building as well. And now we have to get to the roof. As long as I can manage to kill the cops, uh, then I'll be happy. Because I mean, the cops have so much loot on them most of the time, you just don't get to hit them all the time. Too bad there isn't a skill that can make you scrap stuff faster. Okay, so the next building is this one over there. Hmm, I might just quickly... Where's the minibike? Over here. I just quickly run over to it, but I need to see where the minibike is first. Yep, okay, let's just take the minibike with us. Since we have a few things that we need to put away anyways. Okay, so even the bank I might leave till later since we need to crack open all those safes. 
gonna take a while to crack, uh, crack them open. I want to crack them open. Seems there's no dogs and uh, even the cop that was here disappeared. This is actually going a lot faster than I thought it would. Cool, we have a nail gun frame. So we'll actually be able to have quite a few nail guns now. I think we have enough parts to make our third one. I'm just so damn tired. As most of you guys know, I'm a swimming instructor and I just got done with my day's teaching. And damn, these kids make you tired. It's actually amazed, uh, amazing how tired you can get from working with kids. So this game is actually my way just to unwind. I've noticed that even now in this playthrough, or the, so far the shops we've hit, we haven't gotten any of the calipers yet. So it seems you can only buy them in this uh, version, in this game. As I'm not going to keep every single item that I find, especially items that I have abundance of at home. Like nails, it's easy enough to make so I can scrap all of them. I'm actually amazed at the lack of zombies that we are facing now. Okay, so over the street is just the bar. We can more or less loot the bar and the um, bank, but I think the back section, the safes, I'll leave for later. Because I don't want to spend the whole episode just whacking on safes. We headed up the mini bike, I keep forgetting. So this is full over here. We need to go drop a few things off, it seems. Let's just see if we can drop anything else. Ooh, I so badly want to put the shopping basket in. But if I do that, it's going to drop everything that I have over here. So let's just quickly do the bank and the bar, and then we go drop off everything we have. So it's going over there. It's going to make a U-turn. As afraid as I am out of landmines, I'd rather go to these back streets and avoid the zombies than face the zombies head on. Because I know that even though we're having quite a few, quite a lack of zombies now, as soon as we start to encounter zombies, they're gonna overwhelm us. I wonder if there's such a lack of zombies because we were past this area. Remember guys, we scouted this whole uh, city and it spawned all the zombies. So I wonder if that's the cause for the lack of zombies now. Quickly free some space up. It's actually amazing how slowly we are moving through the city. I thought it would be a lot faster. Even with the level, uh, or the max level 3 looting skill. It's taking quite a while to actually open and close everything, especially avoiding the zombies. Okay, so the mini bike is back here. Or at least it should be. Where did I. Oh, it's over here. For a moment there, <laughs> I started to panic. After you get inside, there's a bee. Do not want to get seen now. Okay, since I have the wrench, I can just well take these chairs apart. Because I mean, we get the parts easy enough for these. Oh shit. If there is a... Where is that zombie? If there's a spider zombie in the vicinity, we're gonna get trouble. He's inside, so I'll have to attract attention just to kill him. Of 
Great, there's a cop outside as well. Uh, let's just quickly make some space before before we actually attack them. Uh, nitrate we need. Boots. Uh, throw it away for now. Dog. Which side? Which side? Please come in straight for me. Wow, he's powerful. Two shots and takes down the door. You can say two of his hits is as powerful as a steel axe, steel pick. I'm glad it was only one dog. Especially if they swarm the building, then I don't know from which direction they're gonna hit. Okay, that's all. I might just we could do this as well. Um, let's grab this one. Okay, so the safe's behind there I'll do later. For now I just want to get all the coins I can and loot the basic stuff. Okay, now we just need to find our way back. It's to the right back. It's over here. I'm going to drop everything off now. Let's just go there. And it's this way. So far so good. The only problem now is look at the time. Uh, I think I'm going to loot one more block and then if it gets too late, I'm going to cut away till the next morning. I'm just going to hide away somewhere. Okay, we can take the bullets out of this. Just to give us a little bit more of a chance against the zombies. Uh, this we don't need at the moment. And now... Oh no, I put it away there. I want this. Now we have a proper purple mini bike again. Okay, so let's just see. We have this one shop at the far edge to our left. So I'm quickly gonna get this one and then we're gonna go for these. All these shops. Uh, it doesn't matter. No, you know what? Let's just do only the shops for now. The rest we can do maybe at another time. So the... Uh, even the hotels we'll do at another time. Only these that look like shops we'll do for now. But uh, that actually leaves out the fact that we just did these two. And... Let's just quickly go for it. Also, if you guys noticed on the map, the treasure is gone. It was after that one episode I came back and went to the city and luckily I dug down right on top of it. So I didn't have to worry about zombies, uh, too many zombies finding me. See now zombies are spawning. I think since it's a new area, damn quite a few are spawning. You'll have to be careful, especially since it's next to a burnt barn. So this outpost and all that we'll do next episode. Damn, I don't want to kill too many zombies because the more I kill, the more come. Oh, cop, damn it. If he exploded, it was too close to me, so he would have done some damage. Sh 
Samurai foods. Hmm. I don't think we have to loot this one, guys. We have enough food at the base. So when I get back um, to the city offline, or, or off camera, I'll loot this on my own. Just the important stuff, they can actually get good loot from I want to do now. So that is... Not these are the... Just two left then. All the rest of shops and uh, buildings I'll do off camera. Well, except the, uh, these big plots we'll do on another episode. Guys, I apologize if it sounds like I'm contradicting myself sometimes. But I, I say one thing and I mean it, and then I say another thing that sounds like I'm contradicting myself. Now we're kicking off a lot of zombies again. So the radio station and the hotel next episode. Or another episode, not necessarily the next episode. Okay, let's see what building is over here. Ooh, Shotgun Messiah. We definitely want to loot this now. We need more gun parts. And another shamway, but that will do off camera. No dogs in the area, we're sensed by the zombie that's coming towards us. I have here quite a bit of looting to do off camera. That almost seems to be a rather big uh, sham with foods, but I might just be looking at it wrong. Misinterpreting it. Come on, don't show your place. I'm not in there. Almost already helped me, but I need to do the last one on my own. It's been quite a while since I've seen the large shops. All these shops are still very small. I think the large shops are mostly on their own, standing in the middle of the road. I'll have to make some space soon, because I'm running out fast. Yep, finally ran out. At least we're finding quite a few purple pots. Come on, come on, come on. It's actually starting to get quite a bit late over here. I definitely want to be out of the city before dark. So I only have two in-game hours left. Damn, don't have space. Uh, throw that away. I don't need that. Uh, we need all of the rest. Let's just quickly put a few guns together. Damn, not enough parts. Or for not enough guns. Um, maybe short off another one, yeah. Okay. Damn, what's the chances of a zombie right outside this place? Sniper rifle parts at least, so that's okay. Right, let's scrap this one. Come on, come on, come on. Now I'm gonna have to scrap a few of these bad parts. Do not have the time to worry now. These footsteps seem so close, it seems like they're in the room with you, but they're outside. Okay, so that's all the shops done for now. Next we'll do all the important buildings. So for now, let's just get back to the 
base before nightfall. So there they are. Come on, come on, come on, quickly. So guys, next episode or uh, episode in the future, if you guys want to see it, um, I'll do all the radio stations, the police buildings, all the buildings that are not shops, but are still imported buildings, POIs. I should actually loot all these stumps since they sometimes have quite a bit of awesome loot in them. But the only thing I'm looking for now are nitrate patches, because I need nitrate again. I actually got lucky with those uh, walls of nitrates during my mining sessions because I've noticed that nitrate is the most rare commodity in this game now. It used to be brass since you can't mine brass, but at the moment it's so easy to find brass and it's so extremely difficult to find nitrate. I just noticed that I forgot to take uh, some of the stuff with me. Now that was a blunder. See, I'll need to make a wall for this entrance so I can see where it is, or post or something. So, no, 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 reverse, 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 go in here. So I'm going to put everything away and then I'm going to take a few days off camera just to get everything from the hub and then also dig out these corners, I haven't done it yet, to make these uh, ramps five instead of three each. And yeah, um, when, next time you guys see me, this base will be almost completely steel and Maybe then I'll do the fourth room. I'm not going to do the fourth room now. See, I have a whole storage that I could have taken. Damn it. Okay, let's just quickly go upstairs and see what else we can do for this episode. Do I have something in the forges? No. For a moment I thought I had something going in the forges. Um, let's see, the guns can assemble for the bullets. No other complete guns, so we put the parts away. I still need to sort all of this out. I'll do that off camera as well. As the, most, the reason I do most of it off camera is just to save a bit of time because it's going to be so boring watching me move stuff and assemble stuff and then also uh, improve the quality over here. Okay, so let's see. Everything else that I can sell, I put over here. The basket I want to hold on to to improve the one I have. This I put over there and then cash I put over here. You're not hungry? See, that's the thing. With the skills for food and hunger at max, my hunger barely goes down and my thirst barely goes down. Whereas before I got uh, these two five, say it was just zero out of five, I would have been able to eat and drink stuff in my inventory to make space. But now, for example, the single can, to make space for this, I have to scrap it because it's going to take so long for me to be able to eat it. I seriously hope they can change these. Uh, these planks over here, these uh, wooden signs, because they're so in the middle of the box that you have to aim carefully. If I accidentally press there and press E to uh, open, it converts this whole thing to E. You have to type it all out again. For now, I'm just going to put this one over here. Okay, I think that's it for this episode, guys. I thought it would be two hours, but uh, I think if we stayed for the other POIs, then definitely would have taken that long. But I don't see a reason for it to have taken that long. So. If you guys want to see me loot the other POIs, like the police station and the radio station and all those bunkers and stuff, I don't know if they are bunkers, just an example. Um, if you want to see me loot all those things, please leave a comment down below. Uh, if not, I'll just do it with all the other buildings off, um, off camera. All these normal buildings I'm going to do off camera. So if you want to see me do these, for now, if I go to the city in the time that you see me, uh, don't see me, uh, I'm just going to do the normal buildings and skip all these open plots. And then if you guys vote that you want to see me do these, I'll do these then. So hopefully I'll get your answer by the next episode, so uh, then I can tell what I want to do with the city or not. Okay, so um, if you guys like this episode, please leave a like and share with your friends. Um, if you have any comments or feedback, please leave that down below. Guys, I'm always open to suggestions and feedback, even negative feedback. It gives me a chance to grow my channel. If you guys are new to this channel, please remember to subscribe for more of this content. See you guys next time.